Oh, okay. Uh, welcome. We're playing Bucky O'Hare today. I uh, wasn't sure if it had frozen uh, at that beginning screen. <laughs> Bucky O'Hare and his crew, Blinky, Deadeye, Jenny, Willy, fight to save the Antiverse. Antiverse? From the Toad Menace. It looks like uh, Toad Jam and Earl's ship, by the way, on the last screen. One day, a transport bringing Bucky's crew to the Righteous was attacked. The Toads kidnapped Bucky's crew. They kidnapped them as they passed by them. Blinky is a captive on the green planet. Deadeye is sent to the red planet. Jenny is held at the blue planet. Willy is held on the yellow planet. Air Marshal says, Ha ha ha, Bucky O'Hare, your friends are mine, you are next. Bucky escaped the Toad Armada by a hair's whisker. Ah, 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 shit. He did it. He did it. He went for it and he nailed it. Uh, now he must save his loyal crew from enslavement by the terrible Toads. All right. Uh, we are going to start with the green planet. Sure. <laughs> Uh, I've beaten this game, uh, by the way, yeah, this game is a lot of fucking fun. Uh, it's reasonably challenging, but at the same time, it's not gonna be a fucking, I'm pretty sure this will only be, like, maybe eight episodes at the most, but, uh, it's not, it's not too difficult, I know I'm saying that now, and watch me fuck everything up, uh, but, uh, overall, yeah, this game's a lot of fun, I played it as a kid, and it's, it's one of those games that it, like, it's, it's good. You know, I know what a concept, huh? Where it's like a trademark name. Like, there was a cartoon and there's toys and shit, but... There was a point in time where the games uh, that were made after shit were actually good. And this is one of them. And, uh, so I don't necessarily know which level is best to start with. Uh, what's cool about this game, each... You actually go and find your comrades, and then you can actually play as the other people. And they each have different abilities and shit. Just to change things up. But you gotta start off with just regular, regular old Bucky O'Hare, which which he jumps and, I don't know, his jump is kind of, he doesn't stay in the air very long. But he's got this little, you can charge and do a little high jump. And uh, yeah, this game's a lot of fun. I like it a lot. I've beaten it once that I know of, and I, I, I might have played it a second time, but then didn't beat it is kind of what I'm thinking. I don't recall beating it twice, but I think I've played it twice, but I know I've beaten it once, so that's kind of what I'm going with here. And I also haven't played this in a very long time, so... And I also didn't, uh... Oh shit, I gotta ride... I gotta ride this jam to get the thing. That's why they put it there, right? Oh, come on, break! Didn't the other one break? Yeah, you gotta be careful, because you fall pretty quickly, so... Let's not... Yeah, famous LP last words. Let's not fuck this up! Oh, you fucked it up. What do you know? Those are good. Those give you more power, which... Bucky's power is actually not that good. It just... It's a high jump. And I'm pretty sure you can jump higher the more, uh... the more power you have charged. Oh, shit. Yeah, as soon as I jumped, I was like, nope, that ain't gonna happen. Oh, but that's okay. We keep the power upgrade so we won't have to risk our life to get it again. I mean, technically, we're risking it by just being over a pit. I mean, it's water, but it's essentially, it's a death pit. If you fall in and you die, it's a death pit in my book. There we go. One man. Not sure if it breaks like in Mario Brothers when you... When it goes all the way to one side, I didn't know if both ends would just bust off. Grab the easy one man. I wasn't sure when that was going to fall off, so that's good that I managed to do that correctly. I'm also not sure if I die if I fall... I'm, there's a chance that if I that if I fall, it it just goes dead. Oh shit! No! Oh shit! Yeah, see, I knew that. I I was pretty sure that was gonna happen. Apparently, you just gotta wait a long fucking time before the thing reappears. Okay. I had assumed that it had taken so long that I was like, okay, if it's not here by now, it ain't coming back. But apparently, it did. So, well, I guess now we know. Yay! Oh man, I am. As much, I mean, I don't know. I know it's kind of a, a rule as a Let's Player. You're not supposed to say that you don't like a game that you're playing, but I didn't not like Bob, but man, I, it's a relief. I'm relieved to be done with it, I guess, is the nicest way to put it. It was kind of getting to that point where I was like, oh, I gotta, I gotta fucking, I gotta play Bob, and I was, 
uh, and that level was such bullshit, and I gotta fucking beat it today, like, ugh, but... Oh shit, I was just, oh, I was just fucking around, I was just hold, like... I just held the shot button down, you only got A and B. Well, this is a... This controller looks like a Super Nintendo controller, it has the same buttons, but essentially... Like, you have your A and your B, you have your jump, and I just held the shot button down, but that also charges your jump, and I just fucking jumped. Oh, that was baloney. But anyway, yeah, I am I am just very relieved to be done with that game, and let, I was like, and I was thinking of what game I should do next, and I was like, I want a game I like. I want a game I like. Like, like I had played Bob before, but I didn't really, like, I didn't like it that much. Which is part of the reason why I didn't get very far in it whenever I rented it. I think I rented it like twice, I think. Didn't make it very far both times. But, uh... Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, let's, let's not worry about that one man. We're probably gonna have... Yeah, let's... We got enough one man, let's just go. And I'm guessing I'm supposed to fall here. So I was like, let's just play a game that I know is fun, that I know I'm gonna enjoy. Oh, this is cool. Like, it's falling, but then you can also dodge. Is your... Am I falling faster or are the rocks falling? The rocks are falling faster than me, right? That's what that means. Oh, shit. I'm not dodging well, either. But... I'm pretty sure that whenever I play this, I would always start with the green planet, so I don't know if that means it's the best planet to start with, but... See, I forgot to check what year this game was made in, but, like, this is cool. I mean, like... Like, that's pretty good graphics on those, um... Fucking, uh, toad mobile thingies. And also, there's a, there's an uptick in difficulty in terms of how hard it is to, like, I mean, I guess I could technically... Oh, wait, and there's more life. All right, sweet. Really didn't even need it. Each one of those hits, I mean, I was getting hit a lot, but each thing was only doing one thing of damage. So it wasn't too bad. Let's go ahead and grab this power. Actually, I think... I'm not entirely sure, but I think that uh, it carries over. So, like, the power that he's got, um, if I play him in, a next, in another level, um, I'm pretty sure I'll get to keep it as at full, I think. And also, I'm guessing you're not supposed to get hit by that. Right. Oh, you just gotta do a little of this action. Oh, shit. I'm just gonna try to jump behind him. I'm guessing I could probably just outlive him. Probably just... Oh, no. Game won't let you fudge it that badly. He has to be, like, stunned. But I'm not timing that uh, very well when he runs back and forth like that. This is kind of... There you go. But That's not too difficult. And I timed the jump right correctly once. Boy, you exploded into a lot of explosions considering you just died. wonder if he's, like, a... If he's a well, actually, I never watched the cartoon, so I actually don't know anything about the cartoon. Uh, except the th except that the th I've seen the theme song a bunch of times. Thank you, Captain. I've rescued a toad weapon that will smash walls of ice and stone. It also acts as a rocket pack. Captain O'Hare, allowing you to fly. Woohoo. And now we're gonna go to the red planet, I guess. I'm pretty sure the yellow planet's the hardest. I'm pretty sure it has, um, it has a section in it that is, or I guess it could have been in the quote-unquote wily stages. I mean, you know what I mean? Like, the levels that you play after you play the first four. I remember there was a part, there was like a jumping part where you're riding on like a some kind of moving platform or cart or something, and you have to jump around a lot from cart to cart. And I just remember spending a lot of time there and just dying a lot. And I think that I think that's the yellow planet, actually. So we'll go ahead and we'll wait on that for now. We'll just do one attempt on uh, on this level. We're almost out of time. Oh yeah, and I did actually. Now that now that I'm playing this here, when I first got the emulator, I did play it like a little bit. I was just so excited to have it that I wanted to just play it just a little bit. Um. Which is testing what the R button does. Apparently it's turbo. Turbo to jump? Okay, so I got turbo. And I got turbo here, but I'm not going to use it. I did play the first part of this level just because I was so fucking excited to be like, to finally have the emulator going. Let me switch characters, by the way. Oh, there we go. So now we got, uh, he's got a, a little weird arcing 
down angle shot. And he can also rock it, but it's not very... His is not... It's not very useful at the very beginning uh, when you don't... You also have to be on the ground to use it. When you, have, don't, when you don't have any power, it's pretty much not helpful at all, actually. So this part I actually did play. I did want to, like, play a lot of these games, like, raw. Just so that you get, like, an authentic, like, play experience of me not having played the game in 10 or 15 years or how many fucking years. I do remember you have to go be gentle with this guy. But with this game, I did play the, uh, the first part of this level. And I just tested the, uh, I gotta do the screen size thing differently. And it doesn't, every time... I load up this uh, NES emulator, it, um, oh shit, did I F myself? I might be able to just jump over. It resets the screen uh, size, so I have to re, I have to realign the thing every episode, versus like with a Super Nintendo one, it stays in the same place every time I close it. Okay, this is the part that I haven't played before. I don't even, am I supposed to go to the right? Let me just check up here in case I'm not supposed to fall. Okay. Oh shit. Oh boy, it's like level, oh shit. It's like level, uh, wow, that is instant death. All right. We'll pick this up in the next one. Uh, but I had to pick it, uh, or I have to redo the thing each time. So why was I saying that? I don't fucking remember. Oh, I was going to say, it's like, um, that level in Super C where you have to, uh, just descend and descend and descend. And now this is turning into fucking Flashman stage. Obviously from Mega Man's. There we go, easy enough. Okay, so we'll stop. We'll stop here, and we'll pick it up in the next one. Let me just switch characters now, because that's a that's a P thing, and I want to make sure that dude gets the power and not Bucky. I'm not sure if I collected another thing, but I was going so fast I didn't see if Bucky got it or or if it was just maybe a life up or a one up or I don't know. But anyway, thanks for watching, and we'll pick this up in the next one. Have a good one. Bye.